Yo, it's been a while. What's going on? Yo, appreciate y'all being here. Seriously. Yo, what's going on? Super, super excited. All right, seriously. Like, the, the, that's the only bad thing about uh, playing on PlayStation. Like, every single time that you speak, like, she thinks wind's going in her, in her face. Uh, yo, what's going on, everyone? Yo, appreciate you being here. You know, I was actually trying to figure out, like, you know, hey, should I do, like, a Final Fantasy stream? Should we do a Honkai Star Rail stream? Should, Should we do a Genshin stream? Uh, and then I thought to myself, I'm like, you know something? Honkai Star Rail is going to be this upcoming uh, Tuesday, um, you know, or 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 Wednesday. Um, and I was like, all right, well, we'll we'll, we'll do Honkai uh, that day. Uh, and then I was like, you know something? We got Saturday and Sunday, so we'll probably like, you know, do final fantasy uh this weekend i was like you know something let's go ahead and do the main event for genshin see how far we can get uh we actually have Ch chiori's uh quest to do too so we got a bunch of stuff to do uh thank you so so much for being here uh yo happy friday happy friday happy weekend super super excited uh can't wait uh to uh get into this I have no idea what this event is about. Hope I don't know what characters. 443 says I beat Rebirth, David, smile. I beat Rebirth? Oh, <gasps> really, Pokey? Whoa. Yeah. Um, I, uh, I can't wait to, uh, I, I can't wait to, to check it out, you know, uh, and, and, and try to finish it. I, if I remember correctly, we are on chapter 
10 i think i think we're on chapter 10 um so uh we just beat um uh that fire bitch i don't know uh sapphire scarlet Scarlet, we, we we just beat Scarlet. Uh, we, uh, so evidently, uh, Cloud, uh, like you know, pushed Tifa off the Hello, end. Yo, what's going on, Caputo? What's up? Um, yeah, evidently we we knocked her ass off the the edge because uh, Cloud is all sorts of fucked up. Um, and uh, yeah, that's kind of like where we are. We finished that. She woke up, and uh, you know all that good stuff. But uh. Yeah, can't wait. We're going to be playing Final Fantasy uh, Rebirth uh, tomorrow and Sunday, probably. Okay? Um, so, um, thank you all so much for letting me, like, you know, take off during the week. Uh, I Like I said, I am really, really trying uh, to focus on, on my health. Um, uh, on my actual physical health. Um, you know, trying to lose weight, build some muscle, you know, uh, strength train, uh, and all that good stuff. So, uh, I guess, uh, since last Sunday, uh, I've lost about eight, eight more pounds. Um, so yeah, uh, I still have like 55 more pounds to go. Uh, my mom thinks, uh, get to the point mom thinks that I'm crazy to, 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 go another 55 pounds she says to probably go another 30 pounds but i i want to go down as 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 much as i can uh to tell you the truth i'm sick and tired of being big um so uh but yeah uh thank you i for for the foreseeable future no streams like like i said last week monday through thursday um but i do intend on on doing them friday nights uh one uh saturday and sunday mornings uh and then if i can do a saturday and sunday evening stream um i will try to um but we'll just have to see um i can't promise the evening streams but i am going to try to commit on doing uh saturday and sunday morning streams unless something comes up um 55 damn well uh, kabuto i've already lost 80 pounds uh since uh well okay so a year ago a year ago today you know the the uh this month a year ago um uh i was 80 pounds heavier 80. um but the crazy thing about that but the crazy thing about that is uh, ever since I got back from Disney, uh, January 6th of this year, you know, so we're talking, you know, three months ago, three and a half months ago, almost four months, three, three, three and a half months ago. Um, just in that time alone, I've lost 60 pounds. Uh, so I, I went full on New Year's resolution. I'm not going to let anything fucking step in my way. <laughs> like, I've been literally... You, you know going ham uh on my uh on my health so i've already lost 60 uh in the past you know three three and a half months a grand total of 80 uh but i want to go another 60 um so or 55 i want to go another 55 um so we'll see don't know um I, I i don't know we'll see as of right now i'm still losing it uh you know every day so we'll say. <clears throat> but yeah. <clears throat> super, super excited. Um, but that's why I am not streaming Monday through Thursday. Because uh, the, the time that I get home. Uh, I thought you said 8. Oh, no. No, 80. 80. Like 8 -0. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Um, the uh the but the reason that I'm not able to stream Monday through Thursday, unfortunately. Ghost two says, "How about you dragging this nuts across your face, you old shiny bald man?" Hello, by the way. <laughs> Yo, Ghost, oh. what's going on, man? What's up? What's up? What's up? Yeah, I, I mean, I get home at like f between five thirty and six o'clock, and you know, 
I'm actually cooking my meals from scratch. Whereas before, you know, I was just either throwing it on the pot, you, you, you know, like, you, you, you know, on the stove, uh, you know, in the oven, in the microwave, you know, stuff like that. None of that anymore. Um, I'm literally cooking everything by scratch uh, every night now. Uh, where the hell were you all this time? Oh, well, Ghost, if you, uh, Ghost, you didn't you didn't hear me say last week that uh, no more streams Monday through Thursday because of my um, uh, physical health and everything like that. I, I've been trying to. to Yeah, no. Uh, uh, so I get home from like between five thirty and six, you know, and, and I am cooking all of my meals from scratch now. Um, and then after I eat, I go and take an hour walk, and then I work out in in, in uh, our apartment gym, uh, which is really really nice, by the way. Um, it, I, I've never been in there before in my life. Uh, in the five year, four or five years I've been here, never been in there before. Uh, so I finally went in there and I've been strength training for 30 minutes after my walk every single night. Uh, and then, you know, when I'm done, I take a shower. Uh, and by that time, it's 10 o'clock at night. And it's like, I, I don't have any time. Um, so, uh, I, and it, I would be getting one a little bit later tonight if I didn't get home a little bit earlier today. So, um, anyway, but Fridays, Saturdays and Sundays, uh, I will be streaming. Um, but Monday through Thursday, I, I, I j there's just not enough time. There's just not enough time. Uh, I, I, I can't, I can't make a stream work. You know, I mean, I could stream for like 30 minutes to an hour, but like, it's like, I don't know, man. It, it, it really, you know, it's just too much. Um, so yeah, I rarely eat out. Yo, sork time. I'm telling you right now. Like, I mean, I, I, I used to eat out a lot. Like, I used to eat out a lot, and and it, it was it was breaking the bank. Um, and then I stopped. Um, and then uh, you, you know, I still I still eat out like you know uh, a little bit way way back when, but. You know, I, I don't do it at all anymore because, see, it's the stuff that I eat. You know, it's the stuff that I eat. I ate three hours ago, and I, I feel, I feel complete. Like, it, I'm, I'm, my health has done a complete 360. Um, it's crazy. It's absolutely crazy. I don't have diabetes anymore. Uh, I no longer have insulin resistance. Um, I can have the side effects if I'm not careful. Like, you know, if I go get, like, I, I, when I tell you in the past four months, I have not had any sugar, um, or bread. Um, I like, I am on a super high fat, healthy fat, super high protein and super low carb, uh, diet. Um, and I only, I, I'm a nomad. I only eat one meal a day. That's it. Uh, at, at six o'clock. Uh, and my eating window is 30 minutes, six to six 30. Uh, and then like, if it's not six o'clock to six 30, um, I'm drinking water. That's it. No bone broth, no nothing. Um, so yeah, it's been crazy. Eating out destroyed my heart, my health. Yeah. I see. I didn't really eat out all that much. Like, you know, I, I, uh, <sighs> I mean, in a way I did, but in a way I didn't like, you know, like I never got like, like I never ate out like McDonald's, you know, I never did a McDonald's Burger King Hardee's. Like I never did any of that. When I say eat out, like I went to like, um, you know, Applebee's, you know, Ruby Tuesdays, you know, Chick-fil-A, Chick-fil-A is the only one that I get. That's kind of like fast food. Uh, that I kind of ate out sometimes, but like when I had Chick-fil-A, like I had a salad or, or, or soup, like I love their chicken noodle soup, um, because the, the, the chicken sandwich destroyed my, my insulin resistance. Like I just felt terrible. 
Um, so I've had to, I, and let me tell you something. I am eating so much better. And to tell you the truth, I love it more. Absolutely love it more. I really should 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 do um, like a like a like a paid subscription or something like that. If if, if people want to lose weight um, and and get bit better health and everything, like I seriously have it down packed. I really have it down packed. I mean, I have it to where if you want to lose thirty pounds a month, forty pounds a month. I mean, it, it's going to be hard as shit, but I did it. I mean, or I could, like, I did it the first month, the first month, the first month, I think I, I, I lost like 30 pounds, but that was, that was, that was, uh, that was intense. That, that was a little bit too much. <laughs> Ghost, would you rather have a fat David, uh, that, uh, as big as a Nikado? What is that? Uh, or strong, strong, strong. What is strong? What is that? I'm 633 XP from being a Genshin veteran and becoming an AR60 player. 633 Ghost? Oh my God, you're going to be there uh, either tonight or tomorrow. That's going to be great. Uh, both are good. Uh, oh my God, because David is David. Yo, Ghost, that makes me feel so happy, man. I really appreciate you. How much water do you have? How much? Oh, oh, how much water a day do I have? I have about two gallons of water a day. Yeah, yeah, but 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 not all at once. Like you know, two gallons of water at once will kill you. Um, I I have about um, I don't know, man. I like I, I have about like a, a liter every hour or two. You know, a, a liter every hour or two. Um, you know, uh, and plus I'm on a high fiber diet as well. Like I, I'm I'm on super high fiber too. Uh, so you, 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 you've got to keep the fluids in you or, or it, it just ain't going to work. Um, so, uh, yes, uh, I, I have about a liter, uh, of water an hour. Yeah. Yeah. I, I'm like it, maybe a little bit less than a liter of water an hour. It, it just depends on what I'm doing. If I'm in the office having a liter of water and sitting down for an hour and then having another liter of water, that shall make you sick. But if you're like out and about working, you know, out in the field and everything, sure. Um, but yeah, I, I, yeah, I, I'm, I'm drinking nothing. See, I have to keep full of full for, of water because the hunger pangs. My hunger pangs are between two and six o'clock, uh, or two and five o'clock in the afternoon. That is when I am the most hungriest. <laughs> so yeah, that, that's that's when that uh, uh, gets me. Uh, would you replace bread with tortillas? Absolutely not. I like I, when I tell you I don't do any yeast at all. Nothing. When I eat out, uh, it's mostly the local food. I gotcha. Uh, yo, uh, uh, Kabuto, you have to head out. I understand. Have a good one. Thanks so much for being here. Uh, me, I like to buy spinach tortillas. I gotcha. I get one cup of water uh, once a day, and that's when I remember to drink some uh, because for some reason I don't get thirsty. Oh yeah, ghost. I no, I, I'm I'm constantly peeing, uh, constantly uh, drinking water, and that's all. Like I mean, I ha I haven't had a soda in four months. I haven't had a soda in four months, and I don't miss it either, and I don't miss carbs either, which is crazy. Which is crazy. Uh, I've been bored uh, without your streams. Uh, where the hell have you been? Yo, Black Star! 443 says, David, did you see the Black Swan and Dacaron animated trailer? Eyes. I, I have not, Pokey. I have not. There have been some people that have wanted me to uh, react to something um, or, or to react to, to a few things. I really do have to uh, start. I'm going to start to uh, put like, you, you know, uh, maybe not Friday nights, but like Saturday and Sunday, um, when it comes to gotcha stuff, um, in like specifically, uh, if someone wants me to, uh, like react to something, uh, we're going to have to start doing that. Um, there's one thing, uh, Azur Palani or whatever it is, evidently it's a new gotcha that was like just came out of nowhere. I haven't even seen it, uh, but I've heard that people are saying that like, holy shit, man, this is insane. 
Um, so yeah, super excited about that. We're going to have to uh, check it out. Same Black Star, thank you very much. Agreed. Yo, uh, seriously, Raiden, aka Pokey and Black Star, I really appreciate that. I'm sorry, I'm not able to do it. Uh, do streams Monday through Thursday as of right now. As of right now, um, it, because like I, I've, I, I'm trying to get my weight down before summer. You know, I, I really am trying to get my weight down before summer. Um, and I, I'm, I am going to be nothing but muscle and not an ounce of fat on me by September 1st. I, I'm, I am going to try my best to go this entire summer um, and continue what I have been doing and just try to shed the rest of this fat off. Like, it's driving me insane. I'm completely different. Like, I mean, I looked at myself in the mirror the other day and I'm like, holy fuck. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, uh, but I still have a long way to go. Long way to go. It's going to take some time. But to tell you the truth, uh, I've been a little bit bad. You know, I, 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 I've been a little bit bad. Um, you know, I have my keto desserts. Uh, but to tell you the truth, if I, if I just got rid of my desserts i would probably lose it twice as fast but it's like god man you, you like someone especially that has a sweet tooth um you know it's like it, it's hard to give up the sweets um but like i said all of my sweets are no sugar very low carb but high in fat and high in protein um so yeah i i just but you can't give up everything. You can't give up everything. I did it for the first month. And yes, I saw like 25, 30 pounds come off. But damn, man, that that month was torture. It was torture. Uh, yo, Sork time. Oh, what's up, man? Yo, Sork. What's going on, man? What's up? What's up? What's up? Damn, now I got something in my eye. Yo, D Luke lover. Oh, what's up, man? I just woke up because my mom uh, had a doctor's appointment early uh, in the morning. I got you. Uh, fried oil, cheap seed oil, uh, uh, oxidizer. Whoa. Your uh, mit mitochondria, it destroys your metabolism. Yeah, so Sork, I'm going to tell you straight up. Uh, I cook with coconut oil now. None of this bullshit seed oil anymore. Sunflower oil, peanut oil, all this bullshit. I have three oils in my diet. Coconut oil, extra virgin olive oil that has to be cold pressed and straight out of Italy. Uh, and avocado oil. Those are the three oils that, that I cook with now. Um, you know, I don't do any, like when I tell you everything is organic from either whole, from basically whole foods. I, I mean, <laughs> like I went to go get some sushi grade, uh, like, uh, 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 ahi tuna the other day, um, from an actual Asian outside market. Like when I tell you I'm getting everything fresh. Like an organic, free range, grass fed, all this bullshit, man. Like it costs a shit ton of money too. Like, uh, but to tell you the truth, I'm not eating out anymore. So it's like, you know, I'm, I'm still saving money. Um, you trying to transform your body into a, a slut mode? Well, I mean, I wouldn't go that far, Black. I would. I wouldn't go that far. I'm just trying to to just lose weight, man. You know, I'm just trying to lose fat. You know, uh, I've already lost 80 pounds in total. Uh, I, I want to go another 60. Um, or I, I want to go at least another 30. Um, but if if I'm still losing after like the next 30 pounds, I'm going to keep going, man, until, until I can't lose anymore, you know? Um, and then I'll, uh, then I'll probably go to a two meal a day uh you know type situation because right now i'm having one meal a day um and man from two to five o'clock in the afternoon my ass is hurting like i am hurting because the hunger pangs are damn near killing um but you know 
you drink a liter of water, you know, uh, every single hour of those three hours. And, you know, it, it keeps your, it keeps your, your appetite suppressed. Um, it, it does. Um, so yeah, super, super excited. Um, all right, David, you want to look, uh, like Dio, like Dio, oh, Dio who, who are you talking about? Uh, time to make an account called Delucator. Oh my God. Um, uh, it referenced every, uh, her show. Gods from all Honkai Impact. Uh, oh, did you see the new, uh, Myriad, uh, Celestia video from, uh, Star Rail today? I have not. It just came out today. Oh, <gasps> super excited. Uh, I pull, uh, on the, uh, Chronicled, uh, for D Luke and I lost the 50 50 on Gene. Oh my god, you pulled on the Chronicle for D Luke. Oh, <gasps> you lost the 50 50, uh, on, for, on Gene. Oh no. But the good news, I don't have her, and then I pull some more, and I got D Luke after two years. I, you still didn't have D Luke. Really? Oh no. That sucks. That absolutely sucks. Look, I'm glad that you got him. I'm glad that you got him. Um, yo, so this is, and I've been playing, like, I mean, I've still been playing offline, you know, every day. You, you know, I, I, I do my dailies, you know, on Honkai Star Rail and this game. Um, we're, we're at 55,000 uh, Primo Gems. We were at 42,000, uh, and we haven't really pulled uh, at all. Uh, since then, Hello, um, yo, Tails, what is going on, Tails? What's up? What's up? What's up? Thanks so much for being here. Um, we're not going to go for Chiori. Un unfortunately, the character just sucks. I heard that her story is good, though. So we're going to uh, work on, a st on her story uh, after the event. I don't know how long the event is, uh, so we're going to, um, you know, uh, wor work on whatever we can today. Um, Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah. I put my I put my fate uh my fates on uh on Albedo. Um I'm not I'm not pulling on the banner though. I really it really is a shame. It really is a shame that they didn't do a quaint fates on this. Like the blue fates should should be this. Like that is so terrible, man. Like what a shame. What an absolute shame. Um, but evidently, this is supposed to, uh, like, every, uh, like, after 10 days or, or like, you know, wh whenever the banners reset or whatever, the, the, it's supposed to be new characters, like, you know, uh, out. I, to tell you the truth, I really would like to know what the pool is um, on characters. Because um, I don't know if there's one that we want or not. Um, I'd like to have Albedo, uh, but I'm not going to, I'm not going to spend, uh, Primo gems on him. I'd like to have him, but so, you know, we'll see. Hi everyone. Yo, Tails, what is going on? Tails, what's going on? Um, all right. I've talked enough. Let's go. Um, super excited. I still have no idea, um, what this event is all about. Uh, so, uh, we are going to, uh, uh, it said to go to the Knights of Favonius. Um, oh, oh my God. Talk to Lisa. Oh, Jesus Christ. Let's go. Oh, let's go. I didn't even see that, man, when, when I did this. All right, let's go. Seriously. Yo, Lisa, what's going on, honey? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Let's go. Yo, let's go. Um, all right. Yo, this... Um, let me see here. Yeah. It's at, okay. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to make sure that the background music wasn't too overpowering. Uh, all right, here we go. Yo, Lisa. Oh, oh my God. Let's go. Oh, 
Oh my god, what's going on, honey? Oh, don't call oh, me cutie. It's you, cutie. To what do I owe the honor of your visit? Oh my god. Oh my god. What's going on, honey? Oh, what's going on? Oh, oh. oh my god, she makes me happy. Oh my god. Oh. All right, all right, let's go. Yo, Lisa, what's going on, honey? Damn, almighty, you fine. Let's go. Are you here to peruse the library? Or perhaps you're here to visit a certain someone. Oh, I. Hey, look. It's so. Uh, ooh, oh Pope my God. 443 so says hello. Good to see you, cutie. Oh my God. Yo, Pokey. Damn. All right, let's go. Are y'all are y'all excited? Like I'm super excited. Let's go. Oh my God. Oh my God, Lisa. What's going on? Here? <laughs> as considerate as ever, I see. Alas, what rotten luck. You just so happen to have caught me in the middle of some important work. I'll have to treat you to afternoon tea some other time. Wait, you're actually busy? With work? That's not a sight you see every day. <laughs> you're right. The last time I was this consumed with research must have been way back at the academia. I haven't done this much thinking for a long time. It's rather exhausting. Yeah, I'm sure it is. Let's go. <laughs> if you're that interested, why don't you join in on the fun? What do you say? Want to help me relive my days as a scholar? Oh, God. It's I'll not make polite it. to pawn off your work on other people, you know. Is that a no, then? It will be quite the rare opportunity to work together. And you would, of course, be generously rewarded. But if you don't want to... As you probably know, the Knights of Avonius have long conducted research on alchemy. But most of that research has been carried out in a laboratory setting. The public's knowledge of alchemy is quite minimal. Which means that up to this point, most of our research and discoveries have remained quite distant from people's daily lives. We've put a lot of mora into the research, but have very little to show for our efforts. Noting this disconnect, Jean decided to start an initiative where we'd no. share the fruits of our labor with the people. For now, that means introducing them to several different kinds of alchemical potions. As it happens, I already have some experience with this work. Even though I usually work at the library, I have lent my support in the past to the management of the Knight's Potion Supply. Nice. Uh, you try. Uh, let's see here. Uh, uh, yeah, hated, uh, but he loves me. And now uh, I'm saving up for Nervalette. I understand, D Luke. Um, yo, Black, if you don't eat anything for 72 hours, your body starts to uh, eat away its, its own fats. Well, well, Black, I mean, here's the thing I'm living proof of that. Uh, I have done two. 72 hour uh water fast uh where you don't eat anything for 72 hours um and uh it is a, a depending on how big you are you know uh, depending on how big you are the first one that i did i lost 10 pounds well wait, hold on i think i lost seven or eight pounds when I did my first 72 hour water fast and I lost five pounds on my second one. Um, so it all depends on how big you are. Um, but yeah, I mean, I, it's true. See the, I love fasting, uh, because especially if you have insulin resistance, <laughs> I, I mean, it, it's fantastic. Um, so uh, how it actually works is zero to 12 hours. So like going up to, to basically zero to 12 hours, um, your body is, is basically burn burning the last of, it, uh, of, of its fuel source. Um, and your, your insulin, uh, starts to, to, to come down. Um, and between the hours of 12 and in, in, I, I think it's between the hours of 12 and 16, your body starts to, uh, start, starts to switch. It's, it's fuel source, uh, burning fr from burning glucose, which is your sugar and your carbs to fat. 
Um, and then once you get to like 16, 18 hours, you're in full on fat burning mode. Um, <clears throat> so, you know, for me, someone that does a 24 hour water fast every day, my body is burning fat for six hours every day. Um, you know, uh, but like, let's say if you can go the entire day without eating, which for most people, that is very, very difficult. Um, you know, I could do it. I could do a 48 hour water fast every day, but God damn, man, that would be, that'd be hard. Um, you know, cause see, I'm not hungry in the morning. So if I can make it to where I don't eat in a whole day, it's easy for me to make it to a 48 hour fast, uh, because I'm just not hungry in the mornings. Um, but, uh, yeah, from 24 hours to 48 hours, that's, a, a autophagy starts, uh, which is like it, it it's, it's basically the de-aging hormone or de-aging, whatever, whatever they call it where you are 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 literally uh stop you're stopping your body from aging uh which is which is really really nice um but then the real magic really begins from 48 to 72 hours uh and that's when your body starts to repair its its organs um you know uh, so yeah, I, the 72 hour water fast is, is absolutely amazing. If you can do it, it is extremely difficult. Do the water fast. One of the hardest, uh, congratulations on that. Yeah. I've done two 72 hour water fasts. I, I've, I've done two of them. Um, I'm probably not going to do another one. <laughs> that's just too, that, that's very, that takes a, an amount of willpower that is, I, I mean, it, it's it's almost as hard as as quitting smoking, and and people that have quit smoking, um, they they will understand that 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 a seventy two hour water fast has got to be very difficult, uh, you know, especially if you've you, you know stopped smoking and you were like really really addicted to smoking. Um, you'll understand that. Yo, Acheron, step on me. Hello. Oh, what's going on, man? What's up? What's up? What's up? Um. So yeah, I I, I get it. It, it, it could be it it, it 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 it's difficult. It's difficult. I I'm almost able to do 24 hour water fast, no problem. Um. But by the time that I get home at night, it's like, all right, let's have something to eat. You know, to go the rest of the night to not have anything. Oh man, <laughs> like oh man, it's a little bit difficult. Potioneering was also one of my academic specializations back in the day, so Jean thought I was the best person for the job. But to create potions practical enough to support the daily needs of the people, a lot of adjustments had to be made to the ingredients we use, and the overall alchemical process also needed to be simplified. All in all, what started as a relatively simple research project soon evolved into something exceedingly complicated. So, are you asking us to help you with your research? Cause... <laughs> You're not exactly talking to two alchemy experts over here. <laughs> no worries. I've already thought of the perfect job for you two. Uh, Pokey, would it be easier to eat and after that start your fasting at night uh, or after dinner? Well, Pokey, that's what I did. Yeah, yeah. I, I, yeah, yeah. I, absolutely. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. A hundred percent. You you, you hit it right on. Because see, here's the thing. You, you sleep for eight hours. So you're already eight hours fasted. So, but, but unfortunately, a lot of people have a very, very hard time not eating anything after dinner. Okay. So if you're like, you know, 95% of the people on earth, uh, that loves to have, you know, a cookie right before you go to bed or a snack before you go to bed or, you know, Oreos and milk, 
you know, or Cheez-Its or Goldfish or, you know, something like that at, at 9, 10, 11 o'clock at night, then you pretty much destroy your fast. Um, so what I do is I eat at six o'clock, Monday through Thursday. I eat well, Monday through Friday, Monday through Friday, I eat at six o'clock. I have a 30 minute, uh, window. Okay. So I'm eating from six o'clock to six 30. I stop eating at six 30. Um, and then I don't have anything, any food whatsoever until the following day at six, at six o'clock. So I don't, the, the, the hardest thing, believe it or not, hunger pangs are easy to, well, hunger pangs are a bitch, but they're easy to fight. All you have to do is just drink a shit ton of water and the, the, the hunger pangs go away because it tricks your mind. Well, <laughs> you have a full belly. It's not a food, but it's a full belly of water that your body has to digest, which takes about 30 minutes to to an hour for it to digest uh, water. Water is very easy to digest. Um, you know, so it's easy to, to get a hold, a hold of the hunger pains, but at night, you can't really drink a shit ton of water at night because then you'll be up all night peeing. You know what I'm saying? So, um, you know, usually for me, like I ate about three and a half hours ago. I'm still full, but by the time I get off uh, of this stream, I'm going to want fucking something to eat. Uh, but the past four months, I have, I have just said, no, no. You are not eating a fucking thing before you go to bed. Um, you know, so I have managed to be 14 hours fasted by the time I go to work tomorrow, go to work the next day. So I'm already 14 hours fasted. So what does that mean when it comes to me specifically having diabetes type two, uh, insulin resistance? Well, that means that my insulin depletes while I sleep, which is fantastic. So that means that in the morning, when I get up in the morning and I'm heading to work, I have no insulin in my body. So there's no reason that I feel bad. The problem with me last year and then all the years before, well, I'm having cheese. It's at 11 o'clock at night. So when I wake up in the mornings, my insulin doesn't deplete out of my body until noon. So I have to have something for breakfast because the insulin is still producing in my body. There's something that happens when you're sleeping, something with your hormones. When you go to sleep and you have nothing in your stomach, your insulin depletes faster which is great. That's what you want. And see, here's the thing. Not many people know this or not, not many people ever think about this. When you have insulin in your body, which here's the thing, unless you are a diabetic type one, you always have insulin in your body. Always like no matter what, but there are different levels that, that your body emits insulin. If you haven't eaten in 12 hours, your body's insulin is so damn low that you're able to burn fat. But after you eat something, your insulin goes up. Insulin, it is impossible for you to lose weight if insulin is in your body or, or, or high levels of insulin is in your body. It's impossible to lose weight. Everybody thinks that insulin is used to lower your blood sugar. It's not. It's to keep all sources um to be it, 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 it insulin is meant uh to to where your body will not burn fat it insulin actually if you have high insulin which i had i don't anymore if you have high amounts of insulin that means that your body is incapable of losing fat um you, you know, so you have to wait until your body levels, your insulin levels. Like right now, I can't lose fat because I just ate. 
I just ate, you know? Um, so, you know, but by the time six, eight hours rolls around, right, right when I'm about to go to bed before I eat, you, you know, after I eat, six hours after I eat, you, my insulin levels go go down and then they're fully depleted by the time 10, 12 hours rolls around. So while I'm sleeping, my body's burning fat, starting to burn fat. And then I go through the entire day until I eat at six o'clock from 8 a.m. to 6 p.m. My body's burning fat. So it's really interesting. I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot. But like if you're always if you're constantly eating and it doesn't even have to be like super, super bad stuff. But if you're having a banana here, uh, an apple here, some Cheez-Its here, uh, some peanut butter here, you know, lunch here, dinner here, it, it, you're not able to lose weight because your insulin is up. Yeah, it's some crazy shit. That's why when you do a 72-hour water fast like Black was saying, when you do a 72-hour water fast and you don't eat, your body is just eating itself. Your body is literally, it, 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 your body's like literally saying, yo, to your own body, yo, give me some of your fucking fat. We need some energy. When you're not eating anything, your body doesn't have any anything to burn. So that's why it burns your fat. It's crazy. Um, but yes, it would be easier. So the best thing to do is eat eight hours before you go to bed. That can be a little bit hard for some people. If you can do six hours before you go to bed, at bare minimum, you wanna do four, three to four hours before you go to bed. Um, make sure that 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 you, so if, if you go to bed at midnight, make sure that you are finished eating no later than 8 p.m. You know, for me, I go to bed at, at midnight to 1230, something like that. So during the week, I'm six hours, uh, which is perfect. Um, I would like to be eight hours, but my, my work schedule just doesn't allow for that. Now, Saturdays and Sundays, I eat at around four o'clock uh, and then I go to bed at 12 or 1230. I'm eight hours fasted already. And then I sleep for eight hours. So I'm 16 hours fasted and I feel fantastic Saturday and Sunday feel fantastic absolutely is great so yeah <sighs> hi david i didn't know you were streaming yo mike what's going on what's up what's up what's up thanks so much for being here i really really appreciate you david just a, a heads up and warning i would not recommend watching uh their early access on acheron videos uh because you could get a copyright strike uh this will happen uh, the same thing with Genshin. Wait a minute, what? What the? Uh, are you talking about leaks? Yo, oh, no, we don't. We don't do leaks uh, at all. We we don't do leaks at all. I mean, I like it because I I, I don't want to ever get get. Yeah, no, I get it. Hey, hello. <gasps> what's going on, man? All points are noted. Yo, hey. What's going on, man? I appreciate you. Seriously, much love. Uh, thanks so much for being here, bud. And Michael, thanks so much for being here, bud. Yeah, no, we don't do any leaks. Yeah, we don't do any of that. Alchemical practices are becoming more and more advanced, but there's still a disconnect between our research and the general public. What we really need is to collect feedback from the people. Otherwise, we won't truly know if we're satisfying their needs. But if we want to conduct research and collect feedback at the same time, we need to go about things in a more efficient way. So, I thought the best way to do that would be to open up a potion shop. That way, we could continue to handle the alchemy side of things while also being able to interface with the public and understand their needs. Sounds good to me. Let's go. Oh, it's like killing two pigeons with one stone! Smart idea, Lisa! <laughs> two pigeons. I like that. Well, of course. And who better to take on this job than one of the most accomplished among our ranks, the Traveler. Uh, official content creators uh, post their Acheron videos early, so just be careful. 
Official content creators post their Acheron videos early, so just be careful. Well, haven't they always done that? I mean, I, I know, I know that. Uh, I mean, just because I, I've seen it in Discord. Uh, what what's his name? Um, he's like the best guide maker of of Genshin and Honkai. Um, I want to say saxophone. It's not braxophone. Braxophone. I I, I mean. Uh, they, they always uh i, I mean like it, it, they always do that right i win to lose gaming i've heard of him as well uh yeah him and and uh and and um uh braxophone they usually put their content out like you know the the day or or day before right uh or or a couple of days before i or, or, or so are you saying that there's an acheron uh like a actual like build video out already interesting very very interesting what you're saying that they'll copy strike you if you actually w watch that like live on stream i'd like to see him try i'd like to see him try i would go down fighting i would go down fighting because see uh, you you can't you cannot you like you can't tell people like like other streamers youtubers or whatever that want to react to something or whatever you can't you can't tell them hey you can't react to this even though we gave this other content creator a uh you, you, you know uh what's it called um a special permission to 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 put the video out like i'd like to see them try that gotcha smack already re uh reacted to brack's video already yeah that should be perfectly fine i mean as long as it comes from like a like a um uh like as long as it's not like a leak you know what I'm saying? I mean, if Braxophone has, uh, or I win to lose gaming, you know, if, if they have special permission from Hoyoverse to actually put out their, like, like an early like video and everything, that should be fine to react to. Like it, it's it, it's it's content that is like leaked content that they probably have a a, a pro problem with braxophone oh no they got uh, access to a test server um what well, yeah but like i mean they probably got permission from hoyoverse to actually like you know hey can i can i post this video early or something Brother, like that this guy content con uh creator servers <laughs> interesting wish i was in it i mean i i i'm trying to think that i'm a creator uh or something yeah um, yeah, I, so, 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 um, so, so there's already an Acheron video out. Oh, nice. Very, very interesting. Yeah, that, that's, uh, I, so, so does she need her light cone? Does she need her light cone? God damn, I hope she doesn't need her light cone. When I was at the academia, students would often help out with each other's research projects. Oh, Ghost, I'm sorry that you didn't get me. I'm sure my cuties wouldn't want to miss out on the opportunity to experience that sort of youthful enthusiasm for themselves. Yeah, you make it sound nice and all, but Paimon still thinks you're just looking for a way to pawn off your work. <laughs> I knew I could count on you. When all our work is done, I will personally see to it that you're generously rewarded. Oh, God, stop it. W w generously rewarded. Oh, my God. Ooh. Oh, my God. What's it going on? Oh, my God. We got to stop. Ooh, we got to stop. We can't be doing it. All of the initial preparations Hope have been made, so let's head to the shop. Says we'll Jing finish Lewis our discussion after we get there. yes absolutely yeah yeah pokey because um the the destruction yes the destruction light cone from her to shop uh you know you can s5 that and uh she will do wonders uh with that light cone if you actually have clara's light cone that does wonders as well like i i'm telling you right now i am making it my mission 
in Honkai Star Rail to S5 every single standard banner uh, like cone. Every single one. <laughs> every single one. Every single one. Um, I'm making it my, 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 yes, I'm making it my, my goal. Um, I already have Branya's light cone at S3. Um, you know, so, uh, S4, uh, will be coming up here. Not shortly, but it, it, it it'll be here soon. Uh, uh, hopefully I I'm, I'm hoping to get a Branya S4 light cone by the time that we get around to wishing for Robin. That is when I'm thinking that, that, that it'll happen, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I have like 140 of the pre of the premium currency. You need 600. Um, you know, 600 is like 30 pulls. So it could be, it, it could be getting here soon. You know, I, I don't know though. We'll see. Yo, is that Cal? Yo, Cal! What's going on, man? What's up? What's up? You need her light cone if you don't have a good night's sleep uh, four-star light cone. Good night's sleep. Shit, I don't have my phone to where I can check. Um, good night's sleep. Is good night's sleep like a like a like like a free to play uh, friendly thing? Like, is that something that? that that you can just buy or is that like gotcha exclusive now is our moment <laughs> calm as the breeze my lady yo chris what's going on honey yo chris thanks so much for coming out honey. i really really appreciate you chris what's going on what's up what's up what's up i mean we'll see if we have that light cone um you know, I've only ever gotten two light cones for, for certain characters, you know, only two. Um, and, and both of them were harmony characters. Uh, and you know, I, 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 I don't know, man. I don't know. I, I, we, we I, 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 look, here's the thing. I've already pre-farmed for Acheron. I think we are going to get her, um, I was not expecting to get her light cone, though. Um, but I, 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 I don't think I'm going to. Um, I, if it's just to to help her like do more damage, I really don't give two flying fucks about that. You know, I, I'm I'm more concerned on making uh, like. I mean, I do. Because I like getting the harmony light cones, but the harmony light cones are are probably the most OP light cones. There are some Gusty light Two cones says I'm pretty sure good night sleep will be on the light cone banner of Acheron, so you can just pull on it and might get both Teehee. I don't know, we'll see. I, I'm I'm not sure. Can't wait uh, for the wife uh, Akron to drop. Yeah. So just to let y'all know, um, I will be streaming uh, probably that night uh, that that Acheron comes out. Okay. Um, when it when it comes to like you know new uh, like 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 if we plan on on uh, like pulling on a character, uh, I plan on streaming you know, those nights, you know what I'm saying? I, I do plan on streaming those nights. Um, so if I remember correctly, Acheron comes out Tuesday or is it Monday? Cause, cause it's a new one. I, I, is it Monday? I can't remember Monday or Tuesday, maybe even Wednesday. I don't know. I can't remember when, when, uh, the new, uh, uh, like, like when 2.1 comes out. I can't remember, but we will be, you, you know, uh, playing that that night um, and streaming that night. Um, so uh, yeah, super super excited. I I can't I can't wait. Uh, I gotta step up my Akron pre farm game. Uh, I'm like at uh, 73 uh, pity with no guaranteed. I understand. I understand. Have you checked out Azur Premilia? That's the one, Michael. 
that's the one, Michael. Um, yeah, someone messaged me about this and said, this game absolutely looks insane. So, uh, Michael, I think we're actually going to do some, um, like, reaction uh like, like reactions on tomorrow's stream or sunday stream or something like that um i heard that that has like a 20 minute video or something like that so i would like to check it out and and see it uh evidently they say it's it's genshin impact meets pal world which just it's just which is just insane like that's just awesome man i'm currently pre-farming for robin you know something chris you want to know the thing that's nasty right now like you want to know what's absolutely nasty right now i've already pre-farmed for acheron and robin I've already pre-farmed for both of them. So to tell you the truth, and see, I don't think we're going for Adventurine, and I don't think I'm going for a uh, guy version of our Lachino either, because uh, he's Hunt, and I'm not really a fan of Hunt characters. Um, and I, 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 Adventurine just doesn't seem all that good. Um, so we got, like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm wondering what the hell I'm going to be farming for. Uh, because I don't have... I only have like 20 of those gold things. Um, and, you know, 16 of them are going to Acheron and Robin. You know, so it's like... You don't have that much. Boot Hill, yeah. What? A, yeah, Booty Hill, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so... Um, you know, and it's hard because, like, you know, I, I can't really farm for other characters because, I mean, I guess I could just pre-farm their traces and, and not uh, activate, like, their main traces. But, see, that's what you kind of really, that, that's what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, uh, we we might start farming for some artifacts. You know, I, I, I don't know. Um, but, like, I do like I, 443 says three days and 17 hours left. Really? Okay. Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. So it's Tuesday, right? Tuesday night. Okay, so it, it's going to be Tuesday night. All right. Yeah. 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 So we'll. Yeah. We'll. We'll see. We'll see. All right, I have got to take a piss. Don't go anywhere. I'm going to finish uh, uh, reading the comments, all right? Hold on for one second. Uh, give me like 60 seconds.
All right, I'm back. I'm making sure I have everything for Robin. I understand. Also, thank God that Gallagher is going to be a free pick for the next event. Oh, no! Oh, no! Oh, you know who's here now. Oh, you know who's here now. Yo, Onion! What's going on? What's up, what's up, what's up? What is your thoughts on Withering Waves video game? Let me tell you something, Black. I am super excited for the... I, I'm super excited for the future, man, when it comes to gotcha games. Like, I mean, you, you have... Uh, what Michael said earlier, the uh, Azure Promelia, you have, um, you know, Project Mugen, you have, um, uh, uh, let's see here, Seven Deadly Sins Origin, you got Withering Waves, um, there's a couple of other ones that I can't remember their name, there's another one called, uh, Oh my god, I can't remember. I, I did a reaction to it. There's a short on it. Uh, I can't remember the name. Black Clover Mobile. Mobile. Pokey, I would love to play it, but they don't have a dead... It, look, here's the thing. If, if these gotcha games or mobile games or whatever don't have a dedicated PC launcher, I'm not playing it. If it's not available on Steam uh at the very least or available on epic game store i'm just not playing it i will say this though i would love to play black clover mobile i would love to play that game because it looks so much fun but i'm not fucking with it man if it doesn't have like you know a way of having like controller support and and have like a really really nice uh launcher i'm not i, I ain't fucking with it I'm just not solo leveling as well there's so much genshin impact is in trouble I, I i'm telling you straight up genshin impact is in trouble i mean because this game has not innovated at all like like it comes out with new story it comes out with new events and you know new characters and everything you know new uh open world you know areas and everything but there's no that like the I there's no innovation on this game you know but look here's the thing I enjoy the events I enjoy the main story I enjoy some of the characters that come out you know I'll be playing it you know until it until it ends um but damn man I these other games and I'm telling you right now I'm telling you right now we're going to be in trouble if withering waves and like you know this this new one azure Promelia, and like you know if project mugen I i'm telling you right now if 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 all of these games offer a much better player experience i can only play but so many games in a day you know what i'm saying so whichever ones are the worst i'm going to quit because i mean i y you know uh, uh azure Promelia is going to be on ps5 and pc michael i'm super super excited like super super excited like especially when you hear y you know games are going to be on uh pc um uh uh and playstation you know damn well that they are going to have um you know a, a dedicated uh launcher you know blue protocol oh yeah yeah, yeah. I mean, Blue Protocol is going to be coming out here. I mean, it, it, it's insane. Anyone remember what four-star character is going to be with Acheron? I don't know. I can't remember. Uh, Mike launch uh, both at the same time. You know, and then, you know, so, there's been a rumor going around that, that uh, Withering Waves is going to launch in like a couple of months. That's going to be fucking insane if that's the case. So, um... You know, I'm super, super excited. Can't wait. Um, but uh, yeah, Genshin is in Genshin. I think is 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 in trouble. Um, you know, I hate to say it, but I mean, I I I seriously think Genshin is in trouble. But yeah, Black Star. What what are my thoughts on Withering Waves? I it looks amazing. Looks absolutely amazing. 
Um, and, uh, you know, it, it is, I, I don't know. I can feel ZZZ is already a flop, you know, and that's going to be a shame. And that's going to be a real crying shame, you know, if it is and Genshin with minor, uh, tweaks. Uh, yeah, I, I, I just, I, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to say for Fu Xuan, uh and then Silver Wolf's uh, next rerun and her light cone. To tell you the truth, Onion, I don't think you need Silver Wolf. I've, I, I got Silver Wolf. I actually regret pulling her. I, she's the only character I regret pulling. She's the only character I regret pulling. Because, see, she's only single target debuff pale is a whole hell, hell a whole hell of a lot better than her silver wolf is is so good what uh, don't get me wrong now, now hold on for a second don't get me wrong I, all i said to onion is that she didn't need her i'm not saying the silver wolf is bad silver wolf is is absolutely incredible she's amazing for for someone especially on a new account but like someone like me that has a lot of the characters i don't need her um, I regret pulling her. I really do. I don't. I don't think anyone needs her. Um, I, it, especially if, if you're a veteran and you've been playing it for you know since the beginning. Silver Wolf and Paler are, are good with Akron. I get it, but like she she single target debuff. I Pale. I always use Pala instead of her because Pala debuffs the entire freaking thing. And, and and same thing with Black Swan too. She debuffs three, three. Um, you know, not everyone like Pala does. Like God, I I don't know if Pala would. Well, I, I Pala will be power crept eventually, but Jesus Christ, man, that power creep has got to be that power creep is going to be insane, because the only. Thing that is going to be able to have a five star Pela Poke is if her skill does something. More. Says you, you back Sorn, Kafka, and Acheron be a good team. I, you know, uh, Pokey, I'm gonna tell you straight up, I'm probably going to get Kafka the next time that she comes around. Now, I, you know, I say that Acheron is light, so maybe not. Um, you know, uh, maybe not, uh, but like, is, is Kafka and Acheron a good team? Oh, it should be. Yeah. Because evidently Acheron, her talent, uh, she gets a plus 115%, uh, attack. If you have one Nihility character on your team, if you have two Nihility characters on your team, she gets plus 160%. Um, but if I remember correctly, the best team for Acheron is a sustain unit. So like Fu Xuan, Fu Xuan, uh, Acheron, um, Pela, and um, Sparkle. That's what I heard. That, that, that's, that's, what, that's what I hear. Um, Dot counts as a debuff. If Dot counts as a debuff, then, then uh, yeah. You know, yeah. Uh, I would recommend everyone get Jing Liu rerun. Uh, way better than Acheron. Michael, based off of what I've seen, man, I I don't know. Like I don't know, man. Like I saw an Acheron do a million damage. Like I'm sorry, I've never seen Jing Liu do those numbers. I mean, I've never seen Jing Liu do those numbers. Uh, I mean, except y y you know, if 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 we're like you know, in uh like a, a, a don't trust a test server. Well, I, well, that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I, like I, I mean, all I saw, like I saw that. Um, but Jing Liu was absolutely broken as what well. Jing Liu is kind of like the same as as her test server numbers, right? Uh, wasn't she, or did she get, or did she actually get nerfed from her test servers? Because like, see, I can't remember. That's been a long ass time ago. God, I remember when we first saw Jing Liu. Good Lord, have mercy. My ass, my ass was was, was going nuts. Man. 
Like I like I was going nuts when we first saw Jing Liu. I was like, dude, like seriously, you gotta be kidding. Um, all right. Go to the shop? Okay, let's go. Where are we going? Yo. Yeah, let's teleport over here. Yeah, he was super naughty. Oh, yeah. Wait, who, me? Oh, my God. Here we go. Yo, look at this nice place. <sighs> this is the shop. Good Lord, have mercy. Oh, my God. That woman is something else, isn't she? Oh, no. oh my God, bro. Uh, got you and Mia. That's a win. Oh, yeah, Cal, where the hell have you been? Hey, Cal, where the hell have you been? Wow, looks like you've made a lot of preparations already. Did you do this all by yourself? Yes. Uh, yo, I'm going to get Acheron and her Lycone on a rerun. <laughs> oh, on a rerun. Got it. Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know yet. To tell you the truth, I'm trying to keep as much money left over on my Apple gift card balance like, like my account balance for like, you know, just really, really like, you know, it, like it, I, I'm talking like if I need to get something, you know, I don't want to get something just to get something, you know, um, and I'm trying to make those funds last until my birthday. <laughs> my birthday's still seven months away. Um, so I need to try to make those last. Uh, so we'll see. It was a group effort. A whole bunch of knights helped out. Jean secured the initial funds to open the shop. Albedo and Sucrose provided the ingredients and equipment needed to brew the potions. Uh, Huahua? Yo, Pokey, if you don't have Huahua, you need to get Huahua. Well, she's the best. She's the best. Uh, I think she's the best abundance character in the game. Not the best healer. But the best abundance care in the entire game. Uh, like, I, I mean, she and Fu Xuan, I think, are the be are the are the two best sustained units. You know, because see, if you go up against a certain if you go up against certain enemies, Locha is going to have a hard time because Locha cannot like mass cleanse. Like Huahua can. Huahua is absolutely broken. She is fucking broken. She is broken. She's beyond broken. If it, uh, Aventurine is about to uh, be the best sustainer soon. Michael, I don't know about that one. I don't know about that one. I mean, look, I, look, we're definitely going to, you know, test out all these characters and everything like that. Uh, we'll see, but... I don't know, man. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. I'm not sure. David, who's the best shielder? I mean, Chris. I mean, Fu, Fu Xuan. I mean, right now? Fu Xuan. Zero Neon underscore down. COOK says that is objectively false. Hashtag adventure me Fu Xuan solos. I did. Yes. Yes. I, I mean, I... If it, well, uh, yo, onion. Oh my God, onion saying that to Michael. Good Lord, have mercy. Okay, yo, calm down, calm down. David, who's the best shielder? Yeah, I, I, Fu Xuan. Yeah, I mean, she doesn't provide a shield, but like she, she's, she is one. She's the best preservation unit. Can't deny that. Uh, Venturine is uh, the. To update. Aventurine is the only answer. Oh my god. Fushwin do doesn't have a shield. Michael, she doesn't need one. She doesn't need one. Especially, like, I don't know if I told you all this because, you know, I haven't done a, a, a Honkai Star Rail uh, stream in, in a little bit. Oh god. Yo, Onion, that, 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 you're clapping for me. Rare David W. Oh, here we go. I, hey, look. I, I mean, look. I, I, I got. It's the truth. I look. Here's the thing, Michael. Uh, yo, he power creeps Locha and Japard. Uh, well, everyone.
power creeps Chapard. I everybody power creeps Chapard. Locha. <sighs> It, it, so, all right, hold on for a second. Hold on for a second. I'm going to be completely honest. Locha is the best unit against Sam. Like, <clears throat> he is the best unit against Sam. Like, so, so in... <clears throat> In simulate, no, I'm sorry. In memory of chaos, in memory of chaos, Locha. If you have Locha, you, you like Sam is a joke. If you have Locha, um, but you know Fushwan, Fushwan, she has a little bit of problems. You know when it comes to Sam, Sam has a very very interesting. Um, he he is a very interesting play style, and you need as much healing as possible because he takes away all your healing. He takes away all your healing, but if Locha, you know, just does his you know regular, you know, uh, without using his skill and everything, and then he puts down his field and everything. When everybody just attacks Sam, even though he is in that other state where it it takes away your health and everything, if, if you put, I mean, L Locha is fantastic. I used Locha on Memory of Chaos twelve this this go around. Um. You know, it, it, Sam should be the next boss in the new Sim World level. Oh, oh, I have no doubt. Oh yeah, I have no doubt. Give Fushuan uh, textured memories, uh, and yes, uh, she does have a shield. Yeah. So, so Fushuan, I because I, I uh, like I was saying, I, I I don't think I've told you all this, but uh, you know, I have so many. Um you know, simulated universe tickets that I went ahead and S5 uh, the preservation light cone. And I put that on Fu Xuan, uh or Fu Xuan, Fu Xuan, Fu Xuan, whatever, Fu Xuan. And, and um, uh, yeah, she's amazing. She She's amazing. Um, she's awesome. And, and you know, when I did that, I just went ahead and S S two'd S two uh Jepard's light cone. So I was like, why not? You know? Uh I've been playing the game uh with Lynx, Jepard, and Pyro MC as sustainers. Um Well at least you have Jepard. At least you have Jepard, but a Pyro MC? Oh, I remember those days. God damn, I remember those fucking days. Oh, I remember those days. Oh, that oh, it was terrible. Terrible, terrible days. I'm sorry. I am so, so sorry. My my life changed when I got Fu Shuen. Uh, and then my life changed even... Then my life really changed... When I got whoa, whoa. life changed. Like those are the only two sustainer units that you'll ever need: Fushwin and uh, and and uh, whoa, whoa. Like those are the only two sustainer unit. Uh, Fire Trailblazer isn't that bad. Well, Chris, I don't know how people use Fire Trailblazer uh, in MOC twelve. I don't know how that's possible. Um, because see, here's the thing. When you get into the upper levels of, of MOC, you need a very, very powerful sustainer unit. She, she's not enough. Like the fire I MC is just not enough. You know, uh, you will not be able to defeat MOC 12. If you need a second sustainer on one team, you, th there's just not enough DPS for that. Um, you know, so yeah, I, I like I because see, at first I had to have two sustainer units in order to even get through it. 
you know but now i'm able to use just one sustainer and that's it um which is really really nice um you know so yeah what about fushwin and clara clara is absolutely incredible the only i was able to 36 star moc last time because of clara i wasn't able to do it without her wasn't able to do it without her i can't wait to s5 her light cone can't wait to s5 her light cone i will be s5ing clara's light cone after i s5 uh branya branya's light cone 100 percent. clara is the best standard character i think branya is the best standard character but I get it. The, the best, like, you know, maybe DPS or something like that. Oh, yeah. I still do not have uh, Zero Neon underscore COO key says common Clara and F.U. Schwen W. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I love Clara. Clara is absolutely incredible, man. Clara, I was doing 300K with Clara in MOC 12 last week. That was it's stupid. It's absolutely insane. It's insane. Um, but uh yeah, uh yeah, I I I, I love um yeah, Claire is awesome, Fush wins great. Um I I you know, Akron's gonna be fun. I don't think I, I mean we'll see about Aventurine. Um I hope Robin is gonna be amazing. Does anyone have her kit? Does anyone have Robin's leaks for her kit uh, that they can send to me? Does does anyone have this like they send it to to my to Discord? I'd really really appreciate that. Um, and then of course, uh, uh, what it was a booty, what, what uh, booty call, booty cool, whatever hell his name is. Um, he's far off though. Like I mean, we're talking three six nine. We're ta we're talking what twelve weeks? I mean, we're talking three months uh, before he gets here. Boot Hill, that's it, that's it. Yeah, Cal, Boot Hill, yeah, yeah. Uh, Branya is not the best standard character. I have uh, that uh, M F E one, and Clara is still better. Well, let me ask you something, Cal. Are you using Branya to make Clara even better? I'm 20 pulls away from uh, picking my free standard character. I have uh, Branya E2. Oh, wait a minute. You have Branya. What? You have Branya E2 Welt, Clara, and G1, an E1 Japard. Really? So you don't have y uh, Yang Chang uh, or, um, or Himiko? Uh, I don't see uh, uh, the Chi Chi of that game. I can't even remember what the hell her name is. I miss using her. I'm be completely honest. I miss using her. I really do, but she she doesn't have a cleanse. So she's absolutely worthless. Until there is a Nihility or a Harmony character, like, you know, a Harmony character, like Robin, for instance. If Robin's talent, let's say, um, will, you know, just have a cleansing ability then I will consider using, uh, what the hell is her name? Poke 443 says, how do Violet. I get another copy of OLC from her to shop? Because it tells me it's sold out. How do I get another copy of a light cone from her to shop? Because it tells me it's a, oh, you can only get one light cone from her to shop, uh, of, of whatever light cone. You can only get the light cone once, but you can S5 it. You can't get more than one light cone from uh, her to shop. Uh, what well, you can get a light, you can get one light cone out of all the light cones that are available, but you can S five it. You can't get multiple of the same light cone. Yeah, you can't do that, unfortunately. I don't have Branya, uh, and my Clara is still better. Uh, pair her with Fushwin, and uh, Claire is unkillable and uh, become even more of a tank. Chris, I'm tell you straight up: once you get Branya, your Clara is going to be twice as strong. Like, here's the thing: 
I have an S3 Bronya Light Cone. She gets an insane amount of energy recharge, my Bronya, because I've I I S3 I S3 her uh, her Light Cone. When you get her S5, instead of her uh, doing like I think it's was it like twenty percent more damage or something like that she does like 40 or 60 per oh wait a minute i think it's 40 percent more damage but s5 is 60 percent i believe and then she d has like 16 or 20 percent more energy recharge at s5 i can't wait to s5 that light code i can't wait it's going to be awesome um, I have all the herd of light cones. I'm just now trying to get them uh, to S5. I am able to get every single light cone out of herd of shop and S5, all of them. I was just able to accomplish this last week. Um, but I am saving my stuff because I seriously think that in 2.2, we're going to get another Herda, uh, another Herda, um, light cone. I seriously think that we're going to get another Herda light cone here soon. Um, I'm trying to think of, of which Herda light cones, uh, we don't have. Do we have a Harmony? Heard a light cone? I don't think we do. I'm telling you right now. I think. Imagine a harmony. Okay. Michael, I was just about to say it. Please be harmony. I, I think it's going to be. And, I, and I'll tell you why. 2.2 uh, is going to be Robin. And she's going to be in the first phase. And I think that they are going to release a harmony light cone. I, I really think that they are going to um, for her specifically. Yo, Kale, a D. I, I, uh, what? Yo, Kale! I don't know how to pronounce your first name. What's going on? What's up? What's up? What's up? Yo, Kale, you're going to have to. Uh, you're going to, have to let me know. Are you brand new to this channel, or are you someone that has been here before, but you had you changed your name? Or something like that. Like, like, are, is this your first time here? Oh, <gasps> you gotta let me know. You gotta let me know. Seriously, thanks so much, Kale, for being here. Really, really appreciate you. Seriously, brand new here. <gasps> oh my God, stop it. Oh, stop it. Seriously, Kale. Oh my God, are you serious right now? Yo, Kale, what is going on? Yo, everybody, say hi to Kale. Yo, over on Twitch, can we get a clap for Kale? Can we get a clap? Can we get a clap for for Kale? Seriously, can we get a clap? Let's see here. Let's see a clap. Come on, we gotta welcome him. Excuse me, Onion. <laughs> Okay, that's not funny. That is not funny. That is not funny. <laughs> it's not funny. It is not funny. It's not funny. <laughs> oh my god. Y'all are bad. Y'all are absolutely bad. Like, y'all are stupid, stupid bad. All right, who just said redeem welcome? Yo, Cal. Uh, yo, uh, le yo, Kale. Cal, welcome you to the family, by the way. Uh, yo, uh, this was, this was first surprise bomb for me in the early morning. Yo, Kale, thanks so much for being here, man. Well, Kale, I'm going to tell you straight up. I'm going to tell you straight up. We don't get anyone. Uh, on uh, like we don't get any new people at all like like no new people so whenever i see a new name come up in the chat and everything which is very interesting because i make my own thumbnails but tonight i didn't make uh, like, like i i just i literally copy and pasted one of the freaking uh pictures off of, off of twitter 
But, you know, I was like, you know, <clears throat> I don't have time to freaking uh, do a thumbnail tonight. Um, you know, so I, I'm surprised that that you were here. Uh, because like usually I have like professional looking, you know, thumbnails and everything like that. Uh, so seriously, thank you so, so much for being here. Really, really appreciate you. Uh, Kale, I'm just going to let you know, uh, you know, we play Genshin, we play Honkai Star Rail. Poke uh, 443 right now. says, if I run the Mono Quantum team with Sparkle, can I put Planetary Rendezvous LC on Sparkle? Planetary Rendezvous, uh, like cone. Holy shit. Which one is that? I don't even know which one that one is, uh, Pokey. Planetary Rendezvous? Interesting. Planetary Rendezvous. I've never heard of that one. Let me, uh, let me look that up. Um, but yeah, Kale, we, uh, uh, we're playing, uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth, uh, right now, uh, as well. So we're, we're kind of like a variety channel. Okay, uh, so uh, if, if if that tickles your fancy, yo, thanks so much for being here, and you can come hang out with us anytime. Seriously, uh, all right. Upon battle entry, no, no, I would not do that one because that only works uh, when you first get into battle, uh, and then like you know after a certain amount of turns or whatever it goes away now it says that the rating is a i don't know why the hell they would put that because that's upon battle entry i wouldn't do that th th there's so many other uh better ones out there i would uh lc uh yeah, what does lc mean see i'm stupid when it comes to that uh laughing out loud i too play uh genshin uh nice to meet you yo kale what's going on man seriously much love thanks so much for being here you can come hang out with us anytime anytime um uh asta's uh lycone yeah it's asta's lycone yeah 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 i i would I, I wouldn't go with that one because see sparkle um i you know it's hard to, it's hard for me to tell you which which one uh to to put on sparkle other than her actual light cone because see sparkle i would try is there another harmony light cone that uh in, uh that uh increases crit damage because see that's what sparkle uh you know scales off of is crit damage um so you want to try to you, you know give her as much crit damage as possible uh, it's not that one. It's the Astralicone that has the same effect as the Pentacone Sphere and Rope. Oh, no, you know, I saw it. I saw it. Yeah, it's the uh, it's the Astralicone. Yeah, yeah, I saw it. I, I don't like any that say upon battle entry. Because that means that after, like, you know, one, two, three, up to, like, five turns or something like that, uh, you know, it goes away completely. I hate that. Um, you know, so it's like, you're going to be w wasting, you, you know, it's going to be wasted. So there's got to be s uh, another light cone that's better for, her. uh, I still recommend past and future, uh, four star light cone past and future past and future, uh, past and future. Let me see here. Oh yeah, passive. When the wearer uses their skill, the next ally take an action, except the wearer uh, deals sixteen percent uh, increased damage for for one turn. To tell you the truth, it, it I think it's very easy to get an S five of that uh, light cone. As a matter of fact, uh, dance, dance, dance. I believe is a is is a damn good one. Uh, if I remember correctly, but, uh, past and future really, really good, especially for, for her. Um, because 50% of the time when she uses her skill on, um, a DPS unit, that DPS unit does take its turn. You know what I'm saying? So, um, that would be a very good choice. Uh, Dance, dance, dance. Uh, what is this one? When the wearer uses their ultimate, 
All allies' actions are advanced forward by uh, 16%. That's a good one, too. So I, I'm guessing it's 32% if it's S5. Um, I mean, that's a good one, too. Yeah, I would not use Asta's Light Cone. Absolutely not. A a not Asta's Light Cone. Uh, Dance, Dance, Dance is really good, especially if you have it uh, uh, S5. Yeah, yeah, that one looks good. That one looks good. Yeah. And the logistics company is handling the provision of all future supplies. Now with your help, it's like an additional weight has been lifted off my shoulders. The Knights have been busy spreading the word about our shop over the past few days. So we should be ready to open once we've finished our final preparations. Okay, let's not keep everyone waiting then. Why don't you take these ingredients and try your hand at brewing a potion? Um, Chris had one, uh, Dreamville Adventure. That one sounds like a, like a, like one of the new ones. Um, yeah, that's one of the new ones. What is this? After the wearer uses a certain type of ability, such as basic attack, skill, or ultimate, all allies gain child, child, childishness, which increases allies' damage for the same type of of ability as used by the wearer by 12%. Childishness only takes effect for the most recent type of ability the wearer used and cannot be stacked. Now, see, here's if the thing. If we've got nothing else to do, why don't I tell you a story? Poke 443 says, hope we don't see that naughty sounding lady from Lee Lol. The naughty sounding lady? Who's that? I don't even know who that is. Yo, Cal, you have to head out? I understand. Have a good one, man. Thank you so, so much for being here. I really, really appreciate you. Um, so that means that if she uses her skill, the allies that use their skill, their damage increases by 12%. If she just used her ultimate, all the other uh, allies' ultimates will do more damage. Uh, that one's pretty interesting. So S5 is probably at 24%. That has an S rating. That's crazy, man, it given an S rating. Um, so that's a good one, too. I gotta go. Remember uh, to uh, live, laugh, love, Acheron. Comic books are for now, but friends are forever. Um, I have to go. Uh, have a good night. Yo, Michael, have a good one, man appreciate you being here sorry i will come later uh i gotta go for a uh, bath i understand kale have a good one thanks so much for being here thanks for coming out appreciate you enjoy the bath uh asta's uh light cone is actually good many people use it upon entering battle just means when the battle starts the effect doesn't go away yeah but why why say upon entering battle then why even say that? If it's going to activate immediately, why say uh, upon entering battle? Are you sure it doesn't have a uh, if we've got like nothing a, else to do? Why don't I tell you a story? Are you sure it doesn't have like you know a, like something different? Like I I don't know. Um, but like, are you sure it doesn't have like like a like a turn expiration or anything? Thanks for the warm welcome. Yo, Kale, no problem, man. Thanks so much for being here. I really appreciate it. Go ahead. It's just weird uh, worrying people uh, use it with a Pinacone Sphere and rope. I don't know what that one is, actually. I haven't tried that those out. I will say this though, it is a shame that the brand new light cone is going to be preservation. Uh that's coming, you know, th this this upcoming patch. It's a shame that it's going to be a preservation one because I don't need that. I, w I wish, I wish it was a nihility one. 
You know, maybe we could use it for uh, Acheron or something like that. But I don't know. We'll see. Wouldn't let me redeem the clap earlier. Oh, it wouldn't? Okay. Um, okay, here we go. What is this? Place ingredients. Uh, all right. Jesus. Zero Neon underscore CO Oki says the Pinakini thing has the same effect as the light cone and gives energy recharge, I think, meaning even more day MG. Uh, really? Okay. Uh, what in the world? Uh, wait a minute. I mean, I'm assuming this is what you do. I mean, I, I don't even know. There. All right, let me see here then. So, okay, so you can rotate, okay. I still don't understand. All right, wait a minute. T oh, wait a minute. Oh, okay, I got it. Um, so you could use ten of each of those. All right. Well, that's. I mean, good God, man. I mean, who knows what... Uh... Let me see here. Oh, you can... Yo, Chris, what's going on? David, you don't have to fill in all the tiles. Just get it over the 100% mark. Oh, I thought you had to fill all the tiles. Oh, shit. Okay. I thought you had to fill, fill all the tiles. <laughs> Stop it. Don't, don't make fun of me. Noob gaming. You shut up. It's not funny. All right, let's see here. Love's okay. Nice. 
Nice. Ooh, looks like you finished your potion. Now, all we need to do is put it on display for sale. Nice. That's the wrong button. Looks like okay. we're done with all the prep work. Why don't we take a short break over there while we wait for customers to arrive? Yo, so there are like like there are customers that will actually Oh, oh my god, let's go. Let's go. Okay. Oh, it seems like everything is going well. You've already sold your first batch of potions. Not a bad start at all. Nice. As for what potions you should brew next, we'll need to consult the news from the market. That means staying up to date on the latest news and trends to try and anticipate people's needs. It's an essential skill when it comes to business. Uh, that sounds kind of hard. <laughs> Don't worry. I already took it upon myself to compile all the latest news on the market for you. Okay. What do you think? Have any ideas on the kinds of potions you should sell next? Go ahead and try to cultivate some herbs then. Bioalchemical processing can infuse herbs with different effects and properties. Using different herbs in the brewing process will, in turn, alter the effects of the potion. There's a whole bunch of combinations to try. All right, cutie. Why don't you get started? Oh my god. What What if I told you about calling me cute? Like seriously, it's, it, it's driving me insane. Okay, you can't, you can't call me that. Okay. Nice. There we go. Cycles to mature. Expect quantity. Like you've gotten the hang of the cultivation side of things. Ah, uh, I should probably mention, a knight from the logistics company has arrived. She'll be the one handling the provision of all future supplies. You should go have a chat with her in a little bit. And after that, it'll be your time to shine. Yeah, shouldn't it be our time to shine? You know, the three of us? What about your role in all this? My role? <laughs> Naturally, it was to ensure my cuties had all the business and alchemy knowledge they needed to succeed. Okay, I'll be rooting for you. Good luck. Oh. Uh, I might knew this would happen. Mm. Let's go. Uh, talk to Freda. Okay. Greetings, honorary knight. Greetings, Paimon. My name is Freda. I'm a knight from the logistics company. It's such an honor to meet the famous traveler and her loyal attendant. Wow, Paimon's fame is really spreading across the land! <laughs> um, one small correction though. Paimon's her companion, not her attendant. <laughs> My apologies. I guess I got a bit carried away after hearing all about your exploits. It's just like something out of a novel. You're practically legends at this point. I'm... I'm a bit jealous, actually. I'd love to wander the land in search of adventure like one of those knights you read about in stories. <sighs> Seems like a really fun life. Yeah, that's what I'm hoping, at least. <laughs> anyway, we've got some prep work to wrap up, right? My orders from the Acting Grandmaster are to support your business in any way that I can. If there's anything you need, just let me know. You're in luck! I just got a new batch of provisions. Please, take a look and see if anything catches your eye. Damn. 
Oh, nice. It's all about humanity. Reach alchemy level two. Next cycle, you have not completed all work for this operation cycle. Are you sure you want to end the cycle? Operation cycle. Have right. a question for me, cutie? Uh. Well, yeah, just any... trying to figure this shit out. Um, okay, 450,000. Okay. So if we go over here. Okay, nice. So, how long remaining cycles to mature? Okay. Alright, so then we'll put that on there. And we already purchased all that stuff, so then we got oh wait a minute. Alright, wait a minute. What uh what it, it, it uh here? Alright, what is this? Convectional un oven and enhance. Okay. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so we enhanced that. Um, alright, so are we... Sales. Alright, so we already got that. Now, let's take, um, let's see. So we can't do enhancing. So then we gotta go to the sea. So if we do that, and then we do this, then we do this. Oops. No! There. Then we do... level so now we got to to level two okay to be updated one of three 
Why is it not letting me do it? Potions with exactly the same efficiency cannot be stocked with Oh. Oh, okay. But it says... Let me see here. Concoct potions to accumulate experience. Uh, and raise your alchemy level. The higher your alchemy level, the stronger your potions effects, and the greater the chance for getting even more potions. But then sales. Holy shit. pets they're very cute but see the only way for these to go so i have to end i have to end my uh in the cycle i like i have to end the cycle right i mean i got to yeah because there's nothing else that we can do right um all right so we're going to uh go uh next cycle okay Nice. All right, so then we have this. There we go. Oh, so we go right here. Part of the stall. Nice. And then we go to area change. There. Uh, and then we go. Music is for dancing. All right. So then that'll be up there. So now we try to try something else. Ah. Here we go. Here we go. I have Alright, so this one should be, yeah, a green one. Got it. Okay. Nice, so now we got it. At, okay, and now we got, alright, now I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get it now. Okay, I got it. I'm starting to get it now. Okay, I get, I, like, I'm starting to get it. I got it. Got it. Yes. All right, so then we go over here, and then we're going to change this ingredient to this. We're going to change this ingredient to this, and we are going to leave that the way it is, and then... That's the end operation site. Okay. Now, do we have some other ones? Oh, interesting. Okay. Now, we should be able to purchase something for them. 
Yes, here we go. Uh, improve alchemy. Really? Okay. All right, so then we just bought this, so now there's a fourth one, so that's good. Um, I'm going to have that go. And now we should be able to end this operation set. Nice. Now we purchase this. Yo, you can actually do another one? No, we'll purchase this instead. Harvest all. Okay, so the first one that we did, I think, was like a blue heart. And then that's the second one. Okay, I get it. All right, so if we just do like a bunch of these. Um. Uh, Nice. So now we just got some more, so that's great. So then we go over here and then we put that in. Now, did we get any new ones? Can't remember if we got new ones. Um, no, it looks like we're okay. Now, we do have 5,000. Zero Neon underscore COO Key says it's always a pleasure to see your wife, Queen Yun Jin, on your team. Oh my god, I knew that was coming. I was just waiting for that to come. I was just waiting for that one. Oh my god, that's it. I did. Stop it. It's not fun. Like it, it, it's it's so not funny. It's nasty. We 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 can't we can't do that. There's no way. Stop it. Now we got thirteen thousand. Right. Oh, interesting. Okay, go. Um, so we don't have this. Now we should go up another alchemy level. Hmm. 
Nice. All right, so we take that one out. Put this one on because that's actually worth more. Now, wait a minute. Let's take all of this out. I actually have, I have an idea. Enhance potion. Now, if we can enhance the potion, So we should be able to do that. Calm as the breeze, my lady. David, the free event weapon uh, seems like it will be uh, good for Yao Yao. Yo, Chris, I'm going to uh, like like I I wh where do you get it? The free event it, is it is it part of the it, this event? Oh yeah, because I heard about this. I want to actually look at it. I'm actually uh, really wanting to look at this. Uh, and, and check it out. Uh, yeah, wh where do you see it? Oh. Let's see. Yeah, see, it's a polearm, 9%. Uh, uh, 8 HP. Like, I, I actually... Alright. When the wielder performs healing, restore 8 energy... This effect can be triggered once every 10 seconds and can occur uh, even when the character is not uh, on the field. Unfortunately, this is absolutely worthless when it comes to Zhongli, but I wonder once you get this up all the way, if it's more HP than the black, th than the, uh, black tassel. I, I don't know though. I, I'm not sure. What, what does the Black Tassel have? 46.9%. Uh, you know, because wouldn't it be something else if that one had like 60-some percent? I mean, you just got 20% more health on Zhong Li. That means that his freaking um, uh, shield is going to be 20% better. Like, that's just crazy. Uh, dialogue. Of the desert sages. So evidently it's good on Mika, Yao Yao, and Chevrous. Uh, let's see here. Damn, man. So nine to, at level 90, it's 41.3%. So not as good as Black Tassel. That's a shame. Um, R5 is uh, 16 energy, which is really, really nice. You know, I think that we have enough to... Well, I don't know about that. Chaz... Chasm Light Fin? I don't even know what that is. Um, but, uh, yeah. That could be really good on Yao Yao. Uh, that could be cool. D does Chevrous, uh... Does she scale off of HP? Yeah, it's part of the event. Nice. Yeah, what is it? Oh, damn. We're almost at 50,000 already. Nice. Let's see, 2 million? Holy shit. Okay. Um, alright, so. 
Harvest all those. And then we're going to... That one there. That one there. Uh... should be able to go next side. Hello there, honorary knight. I've heard that you've been helping blah, blah, blah. Okay. Oh, they take two? Oh, shit. Okay. Alright, so now we... Oh, I see. I see. Giraffe in Springville is recruiting hunters to hunt an exceedingly speedy war king. Wisdom. A scholar from Monsad has unearthed an ancient stone tablet that's trying to decipher the information. Yo, should we do should we do a, a wisdom one? Is that what that means? I don't even know. I did the wrong button. <laughs> it's not funny. King Connor. Really? Ew. Oh, that's not good. get two more. Well, that's nice. And that's all that we can have, right? So... 
Oh, what is that? Okay. All right, so I want uh All right, so we're going to do this. We do this. Will be worth more now. All right, nice. So then we're going to take that one away. We're going to put that one down. All right, then we're going to do next cycle. My God! Oh! Oh my God! Ooh. Oh my God! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! We got thick, hey, thick what's women. Up? Oh God! It's been a, a while. Ooh! Oh my God! Oh my God! Eula, what's going on, honey? Damn Almighty! <laughs> Onion, look. What I tell you? What I tell you? I, when it comes to Eula, I can't help myself. I can't help myself. Do you see how thick this woman is? <laughs> oh my god oh my god all right let's go oh my god it's too much it's too much we can't we gotta stop we gotta stop we're being way too naughty we're being way too naughty let's go oh beta and you are wait you two know each other <laughs> well we haven't known each other long but we hit it off right away guess it was meant to be i met captain beta at dormant port she was here in Mondstadt to buy some supplies, and I offered to accompany her around the area. Wow. You were taking the initiative and making friends? Did I not hear that right? <clears throat> Given that the two of us just met, I wouldn't go so far as to call us friends just yet. I was just being hospitable, as is expected of a knight. Huh? Oh, I thought we were getting along pretty well. You're telling me you were just being polite? Oh, no, I, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> I just thought that after my blunder earlier, you probably wouldn't want to be my friend. Aww. Come on, it was just a little misunderstanding, that's all. You're still beating yourself up about that? Honestly, I'd forgotten all about it. Misunderstanding? What happened? Well, a few days ago, after docking at Dornman Port, I thought I'd treat the crew to some time at the tavern to blow off some steam. While we were there, an argument broke out between a couple of drunk guys. Things looked like they were about to get physical, so I intervened to try and break it up. I tried talking to them, but they were in the mood for a fight, and my words fell on deaf ears. So I had to resort to, uh, a more hands-on way of getting them to calm down. Ooh, God, what was it? Ooh, what was it? Onion, I'm sorry! I'm sorry, Onion! Oh, my God! Oh, my God, let's go. 
Eula was patrolling the area while all this was going down, and when she walked in, oh, it wasn't a pretty sight. <laughs> I can't help. I can't help it. Look, look, look. All joking aside, Eula, do you see Eula? I mean, do you how? Do you see how thick them thighs are? I mean, <laughs> oh my god, oh my god, let's go. I can't stand it. I can't stand it, man. Let's go. I should probably take it from here. Recently, we've intercepted a string of attempts to smuggle goods through Dornman Port, so we decided to step up our patrols in the area. Got it. On my rounds that day, I noticed a group of people I'd never seen before, and they were sailors. My suspicions were raised, so I asked their captain to show a valid entry permit for the port. Captain Beto said she didn't have the entry permit on her person and told me to check with the port authorities myself. I insisted that she should accompany me there and, well, you can see how things could get heated in a situation like that. Hey, you were, you were just doing your duty. It was my fault, really. I should have watched my tone, but I had a few too many and... Anyway, it all worked out in the end. I took Eula back to my ship, showed her my documents, and that was that. Misunderstanding resolved. What other stuff? <laughs> what other stuff? You took her back to your ship. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I can't. I can't think about it. I can't think about it. I'm getting so tired, man. It's driving me insane. I'm just rambling. I'm just rambling because it's just driving me insane, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. What'd they do together? Oh my god. Oh my god. All right, let's go. I felt bad, though, so I told her I'd treat her to a drink when we got back to the tavern. Oh god. I'd treat. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Let's go. Once we got to talking, we really hit it off. We sat there chatting until the tavern was about to close. Captain Beto mentioned that she wanted to have a look around the city the next day. I was also planning to head back to headquarters to submit some paperwork, so we decided to go together. Ah, I meant to say earlier, drop the captain and just call me Beto. There's no need for formalities between friends. Oh, yes, of course. <clears throat> Pardon me for being so formal. Anyway, as for why we're here, I heard about your shop when I got back to headquarters, and after discussing it with Beto, we decided to stop by and say hello. Oh, that's right. Plus, I'm curious to see what the deal is with these Mondstadt potions you've been brewing up. Eh, could do. <laughs> Although, I don't have any health issues, and my ship's already stocked with everything I could need out on the ocean. <sighs> Let me think. Oh, do you have a potion that helps with getting to sleep? Are you having trouble sleeping, Beto? Ooh, oh my god. Oh my god. I know some activities that can help you sleep. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, stop it. I gotta stop. I, look, I've been up I've been up for almost 24 hours. And I, I'm I'm so tired. Like I, my my eyes are starting to get bloodshot. It, it, it's I, I'm just I'm starting to get naughty. I'm starting to get very very naughty. I, the, these women are just too too thick, and 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 it's just driving me insane. Let's go. No, not me. The minute my head hits the pillow, it's lights out till the next morning. It's just that uh, I have this friend. She doesn't lack for anything, and she eats right and drinks right, but she just doesn't sleep well. I don't know if it's a case of affluenza or if she just has too many things on her mind. Wait, this friend you're talking about, you must mean... Yep. She's no stranger to rare and precious treasures, but I'd wager that to her, the chance to relax and get a good night's sleep is rarer than any treasure in her collection. Yo, who was she talking about? Who was she talking about? Who, who's Beto very, very close with? Is it Yaimiko? Yeah, who who is she who is she talking about? Or is it Sayu? Does anyone know? Yo, Chris! Chris, do you know who it is? Who's she talking about? Onion. You know who she's talking about? Alright, 
right, we'll get started on that order for you right away. Great, thanks for the help. A bar to Mondstadt hopes to uh, reliably uh, put a good show in their performance and attract a larger audience. Press place for being so fun. Okay. Very, very good. Cool. What is this? How's the potion making going? Hope you didn't run into too much trouble. A special guest will sometimes drop by during an operation cycle. Not um, are, so, uh, so pushes a, uh, a potion that constitution of efficiency or that displays relaxing characters. Perfect. Looks like my gift is all set. Yeah. Is it time for your return journey then? If you're heading back to Dornman Port, I'd be happy to accompany you. Yeah, I think I've gotten my fill of sightseeing, so it's probably time I headed back. Don't want to keep my crew waiting. Traveler, Paimon, I'll see you some other time. Oh, and good luck with your business. On behalf of the Reconnaissance Company, I'd like to express my gratitude to you as well. Oh my god. Oh my god, how would you like to express it? <laughs> yeah, oh my god. Oh, I can't take it. It's just driving me insane. I don't even know what to do anymore. It's just like, God, oh my, you're too thick. You're too thick and you're too cute. Oh my God, you're too good. Oh my God, she's hot. Oh my God, she's hot and thick. She's hot and thick. Let's go. Nice. Uh, what is, uh, let's see. Let's see. Uh, Um, I still don't know what this is. So this two okay.
Yeah, see, what, what, is, what in the world is this? Oh. A potion bottle with very distinctive angles, like a chisel. chisel. So, prove the quality of the potion. All special bottles provide the uh, same uh, Oh. I'll just do that. Oh, that's new. Uh, you know what? This one should be a little bit more powerful than these, I would think. Yes! Very So, should have some to purchase something here, right? May have purchased 9, 12. Oh, we almost already have a, okay, 9 and 12 then. Okay, got it. Got to do the other.
So if we go... Alright, so this would be a new one. Alright, let's go. So these are new. Okay. See, we're not level nine yet. It's only 150. I should have 200. At least. What? Ew. Well, you know something? I really should take these out and then try to improve these. Okay, so they should be... Oh, I see. Ah. All right, 240, 240, 220. That looks good to me. <laughs> Got a little better. Temporary closed. Oh, wait two days. Okay. All right. We are going to end the stream there, everyone, because it's midnight and I'm about to pass out. Um, so uh, tomorrow, or I should say uh, today, um, we're going to do a stream. Um, I don't know when yet. Um, I'm going to try. I'm going to try to uh, go... <laughs> Yo, Onion, much love. Really, really appreciate you. Seriously, much love. Um, so I'm going to try to uh, do a stream. 
I'm going to try to do a stream. Um, I'm going to try to do a stream, uh, you know, later on, uh, you know, in the morning, something like that. Um, I'm going to try. Um, we might play Genshin Impact again. Um, cause I do want to get this event done. How, how much longer do, do we have on this? So we have nine days. So, so we have, um, I mean, technically we have, uh, yeah, we, we might actually play this again. Uh, cause I'm actually enjoying this event. Um, so we might, uh, do this, uh, again, I do want to, uh, play uh some final fantasy 7 uh rebirth uh i really am enjoying that game um we'll probably just uh save honkai star rail uh for uh the update um uh, on like you know tuesday or wednesday um so stay tuned uh just keep an eye out on discord and everything um i probably am going to try to sleep in a little bit because uh <laughs> I during the week during the week it does uh, make it, it, it I am exhausted when it comes to Friday night um, alright that's going to do it for me much love everyone thank you so so much for being here I really really appreciate y'all have a good one and I will see you later on this morning have a good night